Hi Cancer, welcome, welcome to Blue Hill Tarot. We're going to do a start the week energy update for the first week of April 2024. So here we go. Please subscribe to Blue Hill Tarot and I hope you'll stay for the whole reading. Thank you, Cancer Cancer. All right, first message for Cancer is the Three of Cups, uh, the energy of friends, at least three people around you that are holding you up, want to be there with you, are ready to have coffee, tea, sit with you, break bread with you. The energy of the Pisces and the energy of surrender, uh, changing your perspective. This can be a Pisces. This is the tarot card for the month of April. So for some of you, it's, uh, it's a message not about a Pisces. Uh, but about changing your perspective, surrendering to whatever it is that's going on that you may have support around. But this is also a Pisces energy. Uh, the energy of the magician is the energy of an Aries. Uh, so this is you uh, having the tools that you need. Um, a message about paying attention, that you're not getting tricked around something. So we have Pisces and Aries. We have the energy of the Three of Pentacles. Work, uh, people notice you've got what's going on. You've, uh, you know, you've got what you need. Uh, people see that you have a great skill set, whatever it is that you're doing. At your center, you have another three. So we have three threes here. I'm going to say to you, there's a lot of indecision and worry around the energy of the cancer. For some of you cancers, you're disappointed in something. You're saying, why is this happening? Um, it's at the center of your first week in April. Some Somebody or some circumstance may be letting you down and making you feel like, why is this happening? Uh, there's a message of surrendering to that, and you have all the tools uh, to help move it through. The energy of you showing up in position six, this is water. It can be you and another water sign around you. It could be a, you and a Pisces. It could be you and another Cancer, uh, a Pisces or a Scorpio around. It could be someone around your job. Um, it could be anything, but this is definitely your energy uh, that's uh, feeling these uh, disappointments, this energy of, well, wow, why is this happening? The energy of another water sign. For some of you, there is absolutely another water sign, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or specifically an Aries. Uh, the energy of a, the last three in the deck. You have all the threes, and we only have eight cards here, so you have four threes. And the final energy is fire. Uh, that's uh, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. So some of you are definitely dealing with uh, the energy of a fire sign, a water sign. And some of you are disappointed with that connection in some form or fashion. Um, let me see if we get any clarity about whether this is <clears throat> personal or professional. Because we do have a lot of good energy around things that are moving toward you and around you around your goals and aspiration, about uh, having friends and support systems around you. But there's definitely at the center some circumstance that is making you feel like, wow, why did that have to happen? Cancer, cancer, clarity here, cancer, cancer. Okay, so it's around, um, um, it's, uh, there's definitely um, a relationship that, you know, maybe just, there may be new and old relationships around some cancers. Um, there's a message here for you to listen to your intuition around which re relationship is going to be, you know, necessarily worth the effort. You absolutely have a lot of social power right now. Don't be negative or pragmatic around people that you work with. Keep your vibration high. Be a team player. Uh, listen to your intuition. And it seems like some of you cancers may have multiple opportunities around relationships right now. What else? Anything else for the cancer energy for this week? Any other messages? All right, we'll give you one more shuffle, cancer. All right, this much? All right. Cancer, 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 cancer. 
cancer, cancer, cancer. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, so we have two uh, bunch of messages. We'll start with the first one, which is um, discord among friends or family. So this is definitely why is this happening energy. Uh, problems to be resolved. They will be resolved. There's an energy of protection uh, from uh, negative forces beyond your control. That's a, a blessing around you, a guardian, whatever you want to call it. There is a period of prosperity and abundance, earning and um, making things happen positively. And the energy of work show up and you have achievement around you, okay? So it's positive. There's, a, there's some bumps in the road. It felt like the disappointment was around something to do with a professional circumstance that could be somebody that you work with that's a fire sign or water sign, whatever energy they may be. Uh, they they may not be as, uh, you know, supporting you the way that you would like them to. Finally, we have the energy of marriage for some of you and the energy of a new business opportunity or the birth of a child, fertility. Um, so that is a lot of information there for this first week of April 2024. I would say to you around things that are disappointing you, Cancer, to start the week, please connect with your intuition and please don't be looking at things as uh, from the glass half full. Force yourself to be positive no matter, what, no matter what's happening. And also, you have a lot of power around your social side this week. People that you connect with. You have an opportunity there to make something maybe out of something you didn't realize. So take advantage of that. And thank you so much for stopping at Blue Hill Tarot. Thank you so much, Cancer. Have a great week.